I'm Mark Erickson, and welcome back to Infinite Solutions. This time I'm going to show you how to correct a problem that until now you may have thought only solvable by calling your music snob friends. That problem is the misidentified or mislabeled MP3. Before iTunes and the RIAA made us responsible copyright respecting citizens, Many of us naively violated the law by downloading music via peer-to-peer -peer services like Napster and Kazaa. And if you're like me, you now have old MP3 entries in your library like this, with a misidentified artist. Or this one, with no artist listed at all. Luckily, KWorks has written a shareware application that fixes everything. You can download the free droplet application at download.com. The program's name is Front End Convert Drop. While the program advertises itself as a mundane format converter, its hidden feature as an iTunes XML editor is the real killer app. Once the application is unzipped and installed, find your iTunes XML file. This is where all the information about your MP3 library is stored, from song links to artist to title. Drag the XML document over the application and release. The app cross-references song titles and links with the CDDB. It assumes that upon the instance of a discrepancy, that your library has the song title correct. It rewrites the artist. It also strips away superfluous characters like underscores, moves artist and title to the proper fields when they are fielded together, and makes its best guess to fill in the artist where none exists. You can verify the accuracy of the guesses next time you open iTunes as they'll all be bunched together at the top of your playlist denoted by asterisks. If everything is correct, remove the asterisks. Now your iTunes and iPod can be as meticulously organized as your music-loving friends. I'm Mark Erickson, and this is Infinite Solutions.